I want to say to the people of America and the nations of the world, we're on the move and no wave of racism can stop us. Millions marched around the country for equal rights led by Martin Luther King during the 1960s. It was a cause that brought Dory Latner and Joan Mulholland together more than 50 years ago. They met in racially segregated Mississippi. It was Dory's first experience working with a white woman in the civil rights movement. She was also interested in the plight of not only my people but her people as well. I to erase this evil segregation that uh, was bothering all of us, I found it phenomenal and uh, I embraced her. Joan and Dory stayed in the same dormitory at Tougaloo College in Jackson, Mississippi and participated in civil rights demonstrations there. Joan was even arrested twice for her actions, but it didn't stop her. I learned in church about do unto others as you would have them do unto you. And, and then in high school, we had to memorize the Declaration of Independence we hold these truths to be self-evident that all men are created equal. Practice what we preach. And um, that's what propelled me into it. I have a dream that one day... The two took part in the 1963 March on Washington. Less than a month later, four black girls were killed in a racially motivated church bombing in Birmingham, Alabama. Both women attended the funerals. It had a profound impact on me, and it made me more determined to try and eradicate this evil, this evil that was permeating throughout our society. Get the country realizing that change had to come. More than five decades later, the women are sharing their experiences with younger generations around the country. They tell them that one of their proudest moments came when President Lyndon Johnson signed the 1964 Civil Rights Act which outlawed discrimination and ended racial segregation. The students took it to the streets and the lawyers took it to the courts and the press took it to the world and didn't anybody do it by themselves. The passage of the Civil Rights Bill was some of, one of the things that we fought for and has brought about a new day, uh, what we would call social change uh, to a large extent, change in the laws of the country, change in the attitudes of the people. Dory and Jones say despite coming from different backgrounds, they will always share a special bond, one that's endured through the struggles and victories of the civil rights movement. Chris Simpkins, VOA News, Washington.